Hey everybody, this is Brantley from Smart Furniture and I'm here today with Meg from our customer support team. Meg has been sitting in the Carmen chair for a week now. She took this chair home with her last week, worked from home in this chair for a week. Um, similar to the situation we had with Robert, you may have seen that. The week before he had the chair and he came back and gave us his report on it. Now Robert's six feet tall, Meg's a little bit shorter, so we wanted to get sort of a contrast of opinions um, from different heights for this particular chair. Um, so let's take it from there. All right, so Meg, would you say that you have a desk job? I do. Okay, so you've pretty much tested this chair last week. I did. I okay. sat in it all week. Um, just from high level, what was your, what are your thoughts? Um, first impressions, I really liked its um, sleek nature. Um, a lot of office chairs tend to be bulky, um, but this one's pretty minimal. Mm -hmm. And I really liked the recline feature. Um, I felt like I still had a lot of support in my lumbar whenever I did recline. Um, and it was also a lot more breathable than a lot of the other office chairs that I have sat in. Okay, and what kind of chair do you use at home in your home office? I currently have an EMEA chair, another steel case chair. Okay, so this is a Carmen steel case. The EMEA chair is another steel, a steel case chair. Um, and Robert, if you remember um, from our last video, he usually sits in a Leap chair, which is also a steel case product. So we're seeing how these compare, how the Carmen compares to their their other chairs in their line. Um, so we have an Amia chair here. So I'm gonna um, grab it, and we can kind of do a little compare and contrast between the two chairs. Sounds good. All right, cool. Okay, so here are the two chairs. This is the Amia chair by Steelcase, and this is the Carmen chair, the new Carmen chair by Steelcase. So. Um, kind of give us your thoughts about these two chairs. Sure. Well, um, at first glance, you'll notice that the Carmen chair is more sleeker than the Amia chair. Um, you'll also notice that the Amia chair is a cushion and the Carmen is a mesh. Um, so a lot more breathability there. Um, and those are the two main differences I found in this chair in these two chairs. Um, the Carmen's easier to move around. It's a lot lighter than an EMEA chair um, and a lot a lot lighter than a lot of other office chairs as well. Okay yeah and we had that same comparison with the Leap chair too. Leap comes in at about 70 pounds. I'm not exactly sure about this one but it's, I think it's, it's right around it's right, in right around that. 70 pounds also and this one again comes in under 30 pounds. So that's a pretty significant difference For between sure. these chairs. Um, and then, so you, so this was your first time in a kind of a mesh back chair for work? Yes, it was. Okay. Any other differences besides the breathability? Was there a comfort dis difference that you experienced? Um, I think the only comfort difference I would point out is the mesh allows it to breathe, be more breathable. So if you run hotter, I guess I would say, um, the mesh would be nice. Um, that was the main difference between the two in terms of comfortability. Okay, and for lumbar support, you said this one has a pretty nice aggressive lumbar that keeps you upright. Is Correct. that the same for the EMEA? Yeah, they actually have a similar style lumbar support. The EMEA slides up the back and as does the Carmen as well. Okay, right, so fully adjustable lumbar. And so those were competitive? Yeah, those were, that was very similar. Okay, gotcha. And then the arms, we have 40 arms on both of them. Correct. Um, and I don't know, is that, is that a factor for you in your chair? Do you fidget with your arms much? I personally like it because if I'm reading something, I like to turn the arms in. Okay. Um, and also, if you know need to take a break, you can turn your arms out. Um, just a little variety to your day, I guess I would say. Okay, and then we the the Amia chair is a, is a chair that we actually recommend for anyone that's un, under five two if they're looking for an office chair. Um, from a height perspective, did you was there a big difference between these two chairs? I don't think so. Okay. Um, 
I would maybe say the seat pan, I could be wrong, but the seat pan felt a little larger than the Amia, but mm -hmm. I think that's just because this Carmen dips down towards the knees. Um, okay, and that is a noticeable difference, the rim there yeah. um, that's angled down. And this is also that part of that live seat, live back um, that the Carmen is, is promoting and getting known for. Yeah, but in terms of my height, I thought it was great. Okay, perfect. Um, yeah, and Robert had a similar conclusion at, at coming in around six feet. Um, you know, it was, a, it was a nice chair for him too, completely workable. Um, any last thoughts? I think that's about it for me. All right, so this is for everybody who watched this video, which we really appreciate. Um, you can enter to win your very own steel case Carmen chair. Um, there is a link in the description for this video and you just have to enter your email and that'll enter you. you we're going to choose a winner at random um, at the end of June, on June 30th, and send them a chair. Um, so don't forget to enter to win and we really appreciate you guys watching today. Um, it's Brantley and Meg from Smart Furniture. Have a good one. Thank you. Hey, 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 hey.